Okay, we're back. Um, so, uh, we're over here. Decker has broken through a lot of my doors. A lot of doors. <laughs> and I'm very uncomfortable right now and very nervous. I think, yeah, I think we need to just find, like, a tiny, like... put up this door? Yeah, I think we just... this door. ...want to confuse them a little. And please don't follow me. Please don't follow me. For the love of God, please don't follow me. Oh, God. Oh, God! <clears throat> Motherfucker! What the shit, dude? Let's get out of here. Go. Oh, God. Oh, God. That's three blasts. You only have four left. He's just toying with us. We aren't even hurting him. We only have one shot left. You got it, right? Not in front of you, alright? I gotta go forward. Yeah, you gotta go forward. Hope for the best. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Please go the other way. Please be stupid. Please go the other way. Please, 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 please. No! No! Okay. Don't get me wrong, though. This isn't the shitty compatibility between my body sensors and my brain that lets me enjoy murder so much. Although, that junk is bad. Like, VR dramas from ten years ago bad. I can actually hook up to a new neural interface for VR that gives me better sensory feedback than this old military bucket. <laughs> but no, I grew a warm fondness for a bit of the old ultraviolence long before the Department of Defense brain-controlled android soldier program recruited me. I hid my sociopathy well enough to get past the psych screening, but after a few missions I figured it wasn't a big deal. I guess... They wanted to kill a robot, they sure as hell got one. <laughs> um. Oh, I'm like in front of you, right? Yeah, I'm not, I'm not, I don't want to go that way. I want to be further away from him. <sighs> so, I'm like here. And. I guess the only thing I'm going to unlock for him. Maybe he'll go that way. Oh, that's a good idea. Give it a shot. Oh, God. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, good, uh, it, worked. it worked. It worked. Oh, oh yes. good, it worked. Hmm. I have an idea. Don't look at me like that. This may be my mistake to fix, but I don't intend on being dis disassembled here. I have a surprising amount of redundancies. Listen, Decker is unable to track me like he can you. That'll give me an opening. Now, just trust me, we don't have any time to argue. Oh, boy. Hey! Decker! Come and get me! No! 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 What are you doing, you lunatic? Well... Hello, Snack. Did Turing run off, save his own skin, and leave you in the dust? Sorry about this. But it's time for you to say hello to hated... Did the turn just explode? Yep. Dude! Why did you do that sooner? <laughs> That's why. He's dead. That will teach him to underestimate the likes of me. Unfortunately, he's able to damage both my primary and secondary battery packs. They are self sealing, so. He shouldn't leak into my other components, but... Forward display damage. Mobility servos at 15%. Primary control trunk severed. I guess I won't be dancing for a bit. Heh. <sighs> We're not far from the control room. Indeed. I'll have to hurry before my tertiary, tertiary battery is drained. That is a lot of redundancy. Holy I'll crap, have to batteries. ask you to carry me the final distance. This is this is it, the final destination. We're here. Fox only no items. Yes. Yeah. Is it the second time so, I made that joke? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so this is Big Blue. It looks like an egg with smaller <laughs> eggs. All of this sadness can come to an end. This is really it. Right here is the primary control console. Please hook up my main data cable to that port. I should be able to draw enough power to stay active while we need to wait for Tomcat to upload the program. 
Drekker really tore you up. Don't worry. For Decker, the difference between life and death is very slim. For me, I know I'm still operating. How about you? Are you ready to do this, Snack? There's no turning back now. Time to finish it, no matter what. Ready whenever you are. Alright, let's do it. Oops. That's a lot of monitors. Egg! Egg! <laughs> Tell me all of your egg secrets. No. Okay. Oh, it made a pee into the poo. Or maybe it's an egg wiener. Power flow is good. Okay, I'm calling Tomcat. Hey, folks! Took you long enough to call me. I was getting a little worried over here. Well, we ran into a few complications. Nothing we couldn't handle, though. Holy shit, Turing! Your hardware has thrown me all sorts of damage alerts! What the hell happened? Well, you know Mr. Decker? Fairlight's assistant? He, uh, he attacked us. It, it turns out he was a military-built brain-controlled android. He'd been following us around, killing anyone who might leak information that would have hurt Dr. Fairlight's bid to retake Control Parallax. God! So all those people you talked to about uh, Baby Blue's article changes, that Zim Lady, the others? All those people who died were from him? It's my fault! I gave you that lead! I'm the one who sent you there! Why? Why would he do that? I guess he and Fairlight saw an opportunity and used us to sniff out what was going on with Baby Blue. We ended up stumbling into it, and so he followed. I paid him back in kind for the assault, but not without damage to my physical body. It doesn't matter now. What has happened is in the past. I'm ready to finish this. Good. Let's do this. I've managed to clutch something together. It should allow me to compile new personality profiles for any ROM I can push an update to. But I'll need to use you to do it, Turin. I haven't enough time to fill in all the code's holes, but your software self-modification algorithms should be able to handle the rest. Once we're done, we'll push it across the mesh, and Snake can carry you home. We'll see about fixing some of that damage, then. Won't that change his personality? Very well. Run the program, Tomcat. I'm ready. Uploading the program to the ROM update buffer on the servers. Initiating Winter Mute LRP. Loading main directory into Turing's disk. Establishing connection with Parallax's network. Okay, looks good. Now we just need to let Hayden's programming patch things together. Engaging Turing's self-modification systems. Now. Nah. Oh, this feels weird. I'm gonna ruin an emotional part. <laughs> 3.14159265 It's pi, it's pi, it's pi, it's pi, it's pi, it's pi. What the hell? I think the core programming is fighting back? Either that or it's trying to test the integrity of their hardware. I'm getting all kinds of errors. Come on, Turing, focus on the sound of my voice. Your conscious control of your programming is stronger than your unconscious subroutines. I'm trying, Tomcat. It hurts. I need to... The defenestrations of Prague occurred in the 1419 and 1618, although the term defenestration of Prague more commonly refers to the latter incident. Both helped to trigger prolonged conflict within Bohemia and beyond. Uh, what's going on? What's happening to Turing? They're having a kind of... I don't know how to describe it exactly. It's like a concussion or a seizure? They're going to be... Oh, there's going to be a constant flow of useless random information uh, their matrices will have to... an overwhelming desire to soak right up. We have to keep turning focused and mentally aware. Searching the mesh is better than calculating the value of pi, but if they can't stay in control, their personality core might destabilize entirely. 
Tomcat, I need... I need a need, need to find need. Require something because it's essential or very important. I need help now. I'm going to try. I don't know. Something. We can't stop now. Literally. Okay. I was able to stabilize them a little, but you need to keep turning aware of what's happening. Just try reminding them about things important to them. Keep them present. Keep turning and talking. Oh. Uh, uh, remember Hayden? Oh, wait, no, yeah, that's good. That's fine. Remember Hayden? Yeah, oh, I don't know what voice I'm doing. Remember Hayden? You've come uh, too far to give up now. Hayden? I'll never be able to tell him about... Charon, the longest moon of the dwarf planet Pluto, is named after the Greek ferryman of the dead who would carry the souls to the newly deceased across the river Styx and Ardra. So many things. I regret... Psychopomp is the general word for a guide of the dead. Classical examples of psychopomps include Charon, Hermes, and Anubis. Their role is not to be the judge of the deceased, but merely to provide passage. Too much! Their systems are destabilizing further! Shit! Just keep going! Try to calm them down! Um... God! Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! What do I say? Say a thing! Uh... And Turing dies. <laughs> yeah, Turing, when are you gonna show me your paintings? I... haven't... have I? I never did finish the last thing I was working on. Perhaps it survived the ransacking of the apartment. I want to finish it. Snake, you'll be the first one to see it. Bob Ross was born in... No! Focus! I can do this. I can't tell if this is working or not. They've leveled out a little, but their systems are still all over the place. A tech tray. This is a triangular figure composed of ten points set in four rows, with each row having one less point than one below it. A geometrical representation of the fourth triangular number is important to Pythagoras' worship. How much longer, Tomcat? Despair. The complete loss or absence of hope. Just keep going, Snick. Remind them of what they're doing this for! You have to keep fighting, Turn! Uh... Uh... Aren't you eager to pay Parallax back? Justice seems so far away, Snack. And revenge is bittersweet. It is Horus letting rises up with two heads whereof one beareth moat and the other wickedness. He bestoweth wickedness on him that worketh wickedness, and mode on him that followeth other righteousness, and Parallax will get theirs, though, here and now. With or without me, Tomcat will make sure of it. Arrested for the brazen hack on Parallax's ser servers, Julian Thomas was recorded as stating that there is nothing to regret, but Parallax would have to actually give a shit about protecting people's data if they didn't want this to happen again. Thomas's arraignment hearing is... Oh, 60% done. Turn's personality profile looks stable. Just keep them talking, Snack. We've got this. Uh. Uh, uh, uh. 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 uh I don't know. Uh, what about Zinn and everyone else? If we failed, our deaths will have been in vain. They're all. Binary. Dead, Snack. Nothing makes up for that. Nothing could ever. Binary. Bring them back. Oh no, Terry! What happened? You are really slow. I didn't know that was supposed to be like super fast. No, 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 no! Shit! And it was supposed to be, you know, topics that would keep them, you know, thinking about you. Come on, you blue bastard! Blast it! Oh, I got the bad ending! I'm getting fatal errors every time I try to reload their personal profile personality profile into RAM! That's supposed to be me. Oh yeah, that's you. Sorry. I don't This can't happen, Snack Turing! Please! Just get them home, Snack! I'll try to do something! There has to be a way. Find Lexi and get out of there before you get caught. Oh, I fucked up! I fucked up! I fucked up! 
Wow, this is I'm so sorry. different. Oh, I fucked up. I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> well, like, I, I genuinely don't want to play anymore. I feel Aww. bad. I'm sad. Maybe we'll do a special episode where Christmas we come back morning, and get the good ending. Bitterly cold in Neo San Francisco. Christmas morning dawns, and bitterly cold in Neo San Francisco. A chill permeates your empty apartment. You watch the morning news with you watch the morning spirits. news with leaden spirits. You know Big Blue is out you know there. Big Blue, you know that Big Blue is out there. Set to launch on the mesh any day now. Tom Gat hasn't said a word to you since Oh, hey, the actually, ways. dude's you narrating. I don't have to we do anything. Their call. But you know Tomcat blames themselves for what happened. Touring may be gone It's, it's okay, Snake. No, it's not. And you miss them terribly. I'm really already. upset. It's okay. It's really not. I'm really upset. Has been a long year. Uh. Snake, everyone. I'm so sorry. I wish I could have been strong. Well, everyone, that's read-only memories. I'm, I'm really mad. Snake is... I'm really fucking mad. Not doing so great right now. I'm really, 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 really upset. I know it was an extra long episode. Um, I hope you enjoyed our little romp through a cyberpunk future. Um, I'm really upset. I cannot even state the level of upset that I am. Right now, but uh, that maybe is the most unsatisfying possible ending to a game that I have ever experienced <laughs> in my entire fucking life. But maybe we'll I'm uh, really upset. Maybe we'll come back uh, at a point where Snake feels better and get the good ending in in, in another episode. I'm incredibly upset right now. Next next time. Next time, next time when Snake on, is upset forever. Next time on No Nostalgia play Filter game again because he's so upset. Next, Except he's next, totally gonna, next time. totally gonna play this game again because that ending is shit and made him really angry. And now he's mad. All right. Watch the Undertale murder, everybody. <laughs> we'll, we'll see you later.